Labsim certification program from Surgical Science is a validated curriculum for residents in gynecology. Residents who train on a Surgical Science Labsim and follow a predefined curriculum demonstrate a proficiency level equivalent to surgeons who have performed 20 to 50 patient procedures. LAPSIM is the only simulator that comes complete with a curriculum for gynecology surgery and is the most progressive laparoscopic education platform that allows you to make sure all your residents reach proficiency levels, focusing on self-paced and goal-directed learning as opposed to time-volume-based training. The LAPSIM certification program for gynecology consists of three tasks. The LAPSIM expert training course, which is a robust introduction to the fundamentals of laparoscopic skills. The salpendectomy prep and the Larson exam, which is based on a study by Christian Larson that shows a direct impact of lap sim training on outcomes of patient-based gynecology procedures. Residents who pass the lap sim certification program for gynecology reach a skill level equivalent to the experience gained after 20 to 50 patient procedures. Expert training consists of 40 surgery exercises focusing on different skill sets and components where progressive learning prevents the residents from skipping ahead. Once passed all 40 exercises and completed the two additional prep tasks, they will proceed to the Larson course. The central idea is that every resident should reach the same performance standard using self-paced timing rather than spending a certain amount of time on tasks. The Larson exam contains the exercises used in the study by Christian Larson where he verified that virtual reality training improves surgeon performance in the operating room where residents reached the same level of technical skills as surgeons who have completed 20 to 50 patient procedures. There are three exercises from the LAPSIM basic skills in the Larson exam. Lifting and grasping, cutting, and salpingectomy. In quoting Dr. Larson, training in proficiency-based skills should be incorporated in a comprehensive surgical training and assessment curriculum for all residents. The hypothesis was that residents training on a surgical science lap sim improved performance in the operating room. This, in theory, is the whole point of medical simulation training. You train until you show competence, not until you reach a certain number of training hours or tasks. In conclusion, the simulator trained residents scored at the same level as surgeons who had carried out 20 to 50 patient procedures. At the same time, the operation time was reduced by 50% compared to the control group. Dr. Larson is the senior consultant and head of the Minimal Invasive and Robotic Surgery at Copenhagen University Hospital. Be sure to look him up 
for more details. Please also visit us at surgicalscience.com for all the latest news.